day has finally come for us to serve our master. Uh, hey. <laughs> hey, I'm not your master. No, you are not. Get a weapon. I'm unarmed. Hey, Known each other since kindergarten. Yeah! Get away from that guitar! I just tuned that thing. Nice try, lady. Or whatever you are. I'm supposed to think you're a nun, but I know you're really some kind of big, ugly demon, so let's have it. What? Aha! I knew it! Big, ugly demon. Kind of sexy, though, in a weird way. <laughs> Oh, you look like a... Uh, I gotta say, you're probably one of the best fish. Jake, wait. I think I heard once that killing nuns is bad luck. I'd better get out of here. Evil. Please transport me off this awesome corpse pile. I am but a visitor in your strange world, which some would call hellish. But I have to admit, it's kind of badass. Oh, 
lords of gross leather things and S&M type wear. You know you guys really have style. That battle nun, <laughs> she was hot. Uh, sorry about killing her, uh, but you're evil. By your good graces. Uh oh. Uh, I meant evil. Evil graces. Ah, son of a. Oh man, don't tell me I've been slaying hot girls this whole time. The axe. So you've come for it as well. No, but these guys jumped me and... Hang on. And it was just sitting there, so... You handle it very naturally. Yeah, that's kind of strange, isn't it? I've never touched an axe before. Who are you? Uh, right shoulder. We've got to get out of here before he arrives. Yeah. Wait, before who arrives? Emperor Diviculus. Who? Emperor Diviculus, where are you from? It's kind of hard to say. Um, I kind of live on the road. Be assured, you don't want to be here when he arrives. What's the big deal? You're slaughtering his personal guard, for one thing. Oh, aha. All right, Ed. So, what did you say your name was? Come on, we have to run. Take a look outside. Yeah, that's a lot of dudes. What is this place? The Temple of Ormogodon. It's a place of ancient power, but no one knows its true purpose. Simply rocking, that's all. Is that helping us get out of here alive? Action. Minecart? I call it the Druid Plow. Let me show you how it works. What you do, you slam it into goo, hoo, hoo, hello. Looks like it's working already. You have awakened the spirit of the beast himself. I hope so. the bridge before they shut the feeding area gates. Feeding area? What are they feeding? If we get there fast enough, you might not need to find out. Um, what's up with crazy legs? They've called in reinforcements. Why such a large force? What? Maybe because we're badasses. Or maybe Emperor What's-His-Name has something against you. Okay, I haven't mentioned it yet, but this place is nuts. <laughs> yes, these are dark times for our land. But there are a few of us fighting to change the way things are. Is that why you've come? To 
join us and fight for the liberation of humanity? You know, I don't really know. I haven't really thought about it yet, but uh, so far that's the best explanation I've heard. Oh, come on! I'm fucking sick of you guys! All right, while I'm slaying these dudes, you get that gate open, okay? God, she's awesome. Sorry. Did you know those dudes? felt so much safer in the car. Yeah, 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 we heard you. So scary. You'll never French kiss again. What's French kissing? Uh, it's, uh... The, um, gate's open. What? Oh, the gate. <sighs> ah! What's that? I couldn't hear you. It's like you got a lisp or something. Over here, you foul and rotten worm. Come and fight so that I may... <laughs> Hey, knock Future that off! And trails! Come on, you! Over here! What's the matter? Eddie, come back! Wait! Lower the gate! Is that the best you've got? Just come a little bit closer. 
Decapitation! There. It is dead. And you, I will now teach you a... Hang on. I shall now teach you a French kissing. like the car. Yeah. I can't wait to show it to Lars. Deliculous. They say it was the fire beast Omogodon himself? No. Far, far worse than me. It was Sakoria. I can smell her blood. The season of pain is upon us. But why has she returned now? What does she want? War. Finally. We should keep moving. We'll be safe in Bladehenge. Here, take this map. Bladehenge is the center of the human resistance movement. Aha! Army headquarters, huh? Well, right now... The army is just Lars, his sister, and me. What? Come on! Lars is a great leader, truly inspirational. But we've had a few practical setbacks. An army needs food, shelter, transportation. So many details to manage. Sounds like what you need is a roadie. It's a roadie. Uh, it's a long story. How about when we get to town, we have a big powwow with your whole army. We'll have a campfire, and I'll tell you all about what I do and where I came from over a big flagon of mead. What's a flagon of mead? It's a drink. Aren't we in medieval times? I, uh... Ophelia, what demon have you allowed to follow you home this time? Oh, hello. Don't mind Lita. She's Lars's little sister. A little high strung. Lars! So let me get this straight. These performers, they don't even have to tune their own instruments? Nah, that's our job. The roadies. The rock star's job is just to deliver the audience to the promised land of rock. Fascinating. Um, 
Can we get back to the part where you were summoned here from another world? Oh yeah, by this little guy here. You were brought here by Orma Godin? The eternal fire beast? The cremator of the sky. Destroyer of the ancient world. Yeah, I accidentally got a little blood in its mouth and it totally went nuts on me. There are those who speak of a day when Orma Godin the fire beast shall bring a warrior into this world. To destroy us. To deliver us. There is some dispute about the translation, but having met you, I can tell that you are here to help us. To lead us. To wage war against the demons. To liberate humanity. Hell yeah! I mean, hold on a second. I don't know anything about waging war, but uh, I'll tell you what I do know. I know from meeting you, Lars, that you are the true leader here, not me. What I know is how to put a crew together and how to keep it organized and how to take it on the road. That, my friend, is exactly what we need. But I'm sure you must be longing to return to your homeland. <sighs> All right, so where's your army, Lars? We have none. General Lion White has taken away most of our young men to toil in his mines. And he's taken our women to serve as slaves in his decadent pleasure tower. Well, let's go get them back. No, you are not to go near Lion White again. You were almost impaled last time. Compromise. We'll get the dudes first, and then they can help us get the ladies. But time to break the chains! I'll show you the mines, but I think you'll find these chains very hard to break. I can't wait to try that out. Deserve some more weapons, what do you say? All right. Looks like some kind of geyser. Easy. I don't want to burn my fingers off. I gotta give Clementine a breather. Hold still.
These flowers are telling me that this relic needs to be raised. These flowers are telling me that this relic needs to be raised. That's my kind of relic. That door looks like it's meant for cars. It's about fucking time. Not bad. Looks like you figured out the instructions, okay? You've got some demon flesh on your bumper, but that's the way the world is today, I'm afraid. Who? Uh. Oh, me? Oh, I'm nobody. I I'm just a guardian of metal. Oh, wow, great. So, you wanna help me fight demons and stuff? Nah. I'm not a fighter, I'm more of a, what should we say, a keeper of timeless secrets, that's all. Prove yourself worthy. Maybe I'll share some with you. For instance, did you know that this world was once ruled by an ancient race of titans? Now they were something. They took every part of that old fire beast. They took his blood, his fire, his steel flesh. They even took his scream, and they made that car there, and a million other things, including music. Fucking beautiful music, man. And when they rose to the heavens and became gods, they left instructions behind. How to make cars, music, the whole deal. Do you think anybody noticed? <laughs> nah. Bunch of wankers. No one figured out any of it. Until you, whoever you are, so, you must be somewhat worthy of the gods' favor, I suppose. So listen, if you do something that pleases the gods, they might reward you. With a fire tribute. Ha 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 ha. When they've paid you enough tributes, come see me. I'll share some more secrets of metal with you. Like, uh, how to turn that little beast you got over there into a real monster. Among other things. Got it? Metal noise, blood and fire. Yes, take care of it. Now these are a lot bigger. That looks like some guy I used to know. Oh, that guy. That looks already, like some guy I used that. to know. I've got a couple of moves I could. This one's a little flashy, but it gets the job done. Nah, ah, ah. Pain comes in many flavors. You as well, this secret. These strings come with a free paint job, I should mention. Style is important. There's no shame in looking good. We can buff out the scratches while we're at it. The way I'm a Gordon intended. We can buff out the scratches while we're at it. We can buff out the scratch. The way I'm a Gordon intended. Yes. Now these are a lot bigger than I've got a couple of moves. Now these are a lot bigger Already than they look. Already got that. Already got that. Already got that. Style is important. There's no Wait, what do I have to do for a fire tribute? Please the fucking gods of metal, man. Figure it out. Right. Okay. I'll be back soon. Covered in metal god love. Oh god.
job this morning said forever I will hold my head up high I need metal in my life just like an eagle needs to fly so I walk outside into the street from the hall What was I supposed to do when I saw that? Guess there's a Titan relic nearby. That's enough out of you. Hang on, little dragon. I'll pop that cork. Just give me a sec.
So this is it. The crushing pit. Hundreds of our strongest young men toiling their lives away, like their fathers and grandfathers before them, given no tools, forced to break solid rock with nothing but their own thick skulls. Well, come on, let's bust them out of there. Where's the gate? There is no gate. What? They have nowhere to go. No idea how to function outside the pit. Society has no use for them, so they stay underground. I wish I could help them, but I mean... What do you do with a bunch of kids who don't know how to do anything, but bang their heads all day long? You start a revolution, Lars. Right now! It's time to sound the battle cry! Have you been... looking at my sword? I need to get back to Bladehenge before Ophelia does something dangerous. I'll meet you back there, with an army fit for a king. What is that sound? It's a devil screaming. It's an angel singing. It is the pounding of creation's hammer upon the anvil of time. It's fucking awesome. It's called heavy metal. And it's the real reason you should bang your heads, not for that guy. Yeah. Screw this place. Yeah. Let's get out of here. Metal. Hey, hang on, guys. I know we're all struggling right now, but I'm telling you, this is all gonna pay off really soon. Yeah, our manager says that if we just work hard and produce a high-quality product, that we'll be able to move up to cush guard jobs in the General's Pleasure Tower. There's gonna be piles of chicks and booze and stuff. We're with him. Hey, man, sorry, but... but we got a sweet gig here, and we're not about to let you grease bags ruin it. Guard! Riot! Walk out! <gasps> I heard those guys over there say they're organizing a union. <laughs> we'll go sound the alarm! Okay, dudes, don't worry. I have a plan. Hey, did I say charge? Did you know it? Man, I have wanted to do that forever. That's for killing Charlie, you bastard. Whoa. <laughs> hey, okay. See how much ass you dudes kick when you band together like that? That's awesome. Now with just a little bit of practice. I bet I can turn you dudes into a well-oiled machine of death. You into it? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, first, when I do this, it means you gotta follow me, okay? Okay, let's try it. Come here! That's what I'm talking about, okay. Now let's practice moving in formation. Settle up. Right. right behind you, dude. Follow me! On it. Track. Right. Where we go? We're the other side. Come here! Read them. Oh, all right, yeah. Kill it. Learn yourself some destroy. Enjoy. Okay, now, opposite style. When I do this, it means don't follow me. Stay put, defend this hollowed ground. Got it? Uh -huh. <laughs> defend this pile of crap with your very lives. Okay, here we go. Plant it for a sec. Gotcha. Track. Okay. Really good, you guys. Now that means stay put for real. I'm gonna go walk over there and I don't want anybody to follow me. Okay, I'm gonna turn around now. And if I see anyone following me, I'm gonna be really disappointed. 
Yes! You guys pass. For now. But now we gotta huddle up for the big finale. You dudes are with me! All in. Two. Oh yeah, first kill that statue. Now this time we're gonna mix it up. I'll defend this area, while you dudes go kick the shit out of that statue over there. Yeah! Let's do it! Okay, so when I do this, you go completely nut shit on whatever I'm pointing at, okay? Get ready? Kill them all! Gotcha. This is what I like to do. Destroy! Lion White sucks. Death to Lion White! I hate statues! Well done. I'm proud of you boys. But to build an army big enough to take on the real Lion White, we're gonna need some more dudes. We gotta bust all your fellow headbangers out of these stupid mines. What do you say? Are you with me? Yeah! yeah. Metal! Everything in that general direction must die! Check, check, kill the <laughs> Nice work. Now let's go. No headbanger left behind. Grateful man, Cox. Over there. Not our fault. Here. We always 
You think you killed them all, don't you? Well, you forgot my favorites, my managers, the ones who keep all the other workers in line. The only two I know I can always count on. Fear and pain. Code red. R repeat. Stay here and look alert. Oh, my God. 
I think we're gonna need to motivate some more dudes. Your heart's not palpitating now. Call your doctor, because you are dead. the end so people know we're not messing around iron head i like it i don't get it so let's get back to blade hands and get this army started iron head <laughs> 